A match day tour of the Celsi Sharks change room is always a special honour, but when the person giving the tour is someone who has spent many Saturdays prepping for a match in that same room, it's extra special. Former Sharks captain and fly half Pat Lambie, who recently returned to Durban from France after retiring from the game, was invited to do just that for the Michael House first team, a team he captained in his school days. Well, it's a fantastic day uh, having uh, James Fleming and his uh, Mark Louse first team come through to Johnson Kings Park. Um, it's, it's been a wonderful opportunity for them to meet Mark Louse old boy Pat Lambie, uh, ex Mark Louse captain, ex Sharks captain, Springbok rugby player, and um, all around superb human being. Um, the Sharks have always looked at up to Pat as uh, the ideal rugby player and uh, I don't think there's any better role model that uh, these young Michael House guys could look to. The Michael House team was also there to play a curtain raiser match against St Albans ahead of the Celsi Sharks Super Rugby Clash against the Bulls. A yeah, wonderful experience, first of all, for us, just to, uh, for the Michael House boys, even to come and, and, and play at, at Kings Park is, a, is an amazing occasion. Um, added to that, we've, we've had uh, uh, Pat Lambie come and hand out the jerseys to the guys uh, as an old boy, ex-head boy, um, first team captain. Uh, wonderful for the guys to experience that, to get to meet him, and then also to get to hear a few stories about his time at the Sharks and some stories about you know, uh, what it was like to, to come through these change rooms and, and, uh, and be a part of a team. Yeah, seeing the my class boys in the change room and uh, presenting the jerseys to them has been a very special occasion for me. It's the first time I've had the privilege of doing that. And also very proud to be able to show them around here at the Sharks and share some of those memories that, that I experienced while, while I was here during my playing days. Um, so uh, very, very special day today. So there's obviously a lot of history and tradition, proud traditions here at the Sharks and I was able to share that with my class boys. And again, there's some, some proud history and tradition at my class too. So being able to reminisce with the current players um, and compare their experiences in 2019 compared to mine in 2007 and 2008, all those, those years ago, uh, has, been, has been really fun. Yeah, you see quite a lot to us today, especially about having fun and enjoying the game. Um, he, he, he reminisced on his schoolboy games and how much that was really meant to him. And yeah, I just said that uh, what, he means, what he remembered the most is how much fun they had and what a great time it was playing schoolboy rugby. And so hopefully we can enjoy it again today like we always do. It was really a great experience. Um, Pat's an old boy of the school, obviously. And for him to show us around the change rooms was really special for my class boys. So I'm um, special to see what we can do if we really put our minds to it. And hopefully we can achieve something like that today. Yeah, it was fantastic them just walking through um, this morning and the, at the bottom gate and, and seeing the size of the stadium and, and the fantastic facilities of the pitches in great condition. You know, I think it's a wide eyes sort of stuff. I think uh, it'll be quite interesting to see how they go. But uh, what an experience and uh, are they all relishing just to get out there and run around? Look, it was, it was, uh, it was very special being in the, in the change room with the My Class boys again. I, I would love to be able to wind back the clock 10 years um, and start this whole journey all over again. Um, some of my, my best rugby memories were in a, a Mike Lowe's jersey um, and some of my best rugby memories were in a Sharks jersey too. So to have both teams in one place at the same time is a fantastic honour. It's really, really a great initiative that there are going to be schoolboy games here at Johnson's Kings Park. And I saw the excitement in, in everyone's faces when I handed, handed out the jerseys to them. Um, for them to, to be able to play here in a professional stadium like this, uh, it's going to be a wonderful experience for them. Um, it's great for, for Sharks Rugby too. Um, and I hope that both teams, Michael Hans and St. Aldens, uh, have a, a great experience today. And it was a great experience for Michael House, winning the match 26-20.